Hello and a very warm welcome. I am Ruchi Sharma. Bitcoin's price recovery tour took it to a multi-day peak of $64,500 yesterday, but the asset failed to continue upward and has retraced back to $64,180. Ethereum, the second largest cryptocurrency by market cap, was changing hands at $3,152, up by 2% in the last 24 hours. The largest meme coin, Dogecoin, was among the top performers today and it has only doubled down on its run. Doge has jumped by another 6% in the past 24 hours and now trades at $0.16. The other impressive gainers from the top 36 alts is RNDR, which has soared to $9 after an 8.5% daily increase. AVAX, Link and Near are also in the green. In contrast, TAN, SHIB and ADA have declined by somewhere between 2-4%. to ETH, BNB, SOL and XRP are also in the red, but in a less painful fashion. The global crypto market cap is $2.37 trillion, a 1.41% increase over the last day. The total crypto market volume over the last 24 hours is $47.69 billion, which makes a 14.32% decrease. The total volume in DeFi is currently $4.74 billion, 9.94% of the total crypto market 24-hour volume. The volume of all stablecoins is now $43.07 billion, which is 90.3% of the total crypto market 24-hour volume. Bitcoin's dominance is currently 53.36%, a decrease of 0.13% over the day. Node Monkeys has surpassed SAT's BRC20 NFTs to become the top Bitcoin collection with over $1.62 million in sales on 2nd May. This marks a 488% increase from the previous day, bringing Node Monkeys all-time sales volume to $210.72 million. CryptoPunks, the second highest performing collection, saw a daily sales volume of $1.33 million, a 488% increase from the previous day. CryptoPunks' all time sales volume now stands at $2.82 billion, making it the third best selling set of NFTs. CryptoPunk 7846 was the highest valued NFT to change hands at selling for $557,804 in Ether. Board Ape Yacht Club, a fellow Ethereum collection, ranked third in daily sales, generating $1.06 million. Yuga Labs' flagship collection is the second best-selling NFT, worth $3.14 billion. Other notable NFT market movements include uh, D-Market, WZRD, BRC20 NFTs, Azuki and D-Gods. From April 27th to May 4th, 2024, non-fungible token sales decreased by 30.16% compared to the previous week, with Bitcoin-based NFT sales totaling $56.81 million. NFT buyers rose by 37.17%, while sellers increased by 31.1%. Among 22 blockchain networks, BTC-centric NFT collections uh, led with earning of $56.81 million, while Ethereum NFT transactions reached $49 million. Among other blockchain networks, Solana NFT transactions generated $25.61 million, a 23.85% decrease from the last week. Polygon NFT earnings totaled $11.34 million, a 27.38% decline. Mythos Chains, ranking fifth in NFT sales, generated $7.1 million, a 15.39% increase. Immutable X and BNB chain sales also increased by 3.53% to 13.08%. The leading NFT collection by sales volume was uncategorized ordinals from the Bitcoin blockchain, amassing $32.63 million, but its sales dropped 51.18%. D-Market by Mythos secured second place with $6.94 million, up by 15.34%. Board Ape Yacht Club followed with a $4.33 million, a 41.36% decrease since April 27th. The priciest NFT sold was CryptoPunk, hashtag 7846, fetching $557,803, followed by CryptoPunk, hashtag 7846, amounting to $256,550, and a Solana Google at $161,066. Wojak Finance, a cryptocurrency platform, is launching the Gen X NFT collection consisting of 100,000 unique pieces. The collection represents the Wojakian's Gen X community, which uses social media for financial gains. Users can earn BWJ tokens by tweeting, turning their passion into profit. As the community grows, if active users reach 100,000, a significant portion of the monthly generated tweets will originate from this group, providing unprecedented influence and marketing power. The Gen X collection's appeal lies in its size and expected high growth rate, with market analysts and crypto enthusiasts anticipating bullish signals. 
key crypto whales and prominent investors have shown interest in holding the WOG token, further validating its market status. The Wojakians also have an advanced AI model and software suite that creates content tailored to individual users, aligning with their personalities and campaigns. The GenX NFT collection also offers status and recognition on social media platforms, allowing holders to flaunt their characters on Twitter. NFT Bank, a leading NFT portfolio management platform, has launched NFT Bank V2, a new version that offers users an enhanced experience in tracking and managing NFT investments with unmatched precision. The platform is known for its highly accurate NFT valuation and profit loss tracking capabilities and has been fine tuned to detect various NFT acquisition mechanisms, including minting, bulk uh, purchasing, and transactions on secondary market across major NFT marketplaces. NFT Bank V2 also allows users to connect up to 3,000 wallets, providing a consolidated view of their assets spread across different wallets and the most accurate cost basis accounting for internal transfers. This feature makes NFT Bank the go-to platform for NFT tax filing. Users can also manage these wallets in groups, allowing for differentiation in performance tracking across various strategies or wallet types. NFT Bank CEO Daniel Minsukim is thrilled to unveil NFT Bank V2, a testament to its commitment to providing an unparalleled NFT portfolio management experience. NFT Bank has a history of partnering with major games like Axie Infinity and League of Kingdoms, assisting NFT owners in asset management and profit maximization. As MF3 Games and Guilds experience a renaissance, NFT Bank V2 will be an indispensable tool for managing their treasuries. NFT Bank is backed by prominent investors such as Hashed, DCG, Sequoia Capital, Bitcraft, Safimian, 1KX and Dapper Labs. Vyog is a metaverse platform that combines elements of virtual reality, augmented reality, extended reality, social media, online gaming, e-commerce and cryptocurrencies. It aims to create a realistic and interconnected virtual world with features such as avatars, virtual education centers, malls, theaters, gaming arenas, city and island properties, virtual events and cross-platform accessibility. Vyug is built on Polygon blockchain te uh, technology which works alongside Ethereum blockchain for fast transactions and inexpensive fees. Its commitment to accessibility ensures that everyone can participate in the metaverse experience regardless of their physical location. Nexera, the, the capital city of Vyug is now live with its alpha version 1.0 and has opened the J block for users. Vyug's vision envisions a future where the metaverse transcends entertainment and gaming becoming a platform for real-world activities. The future of VR and the metaverse will bring more integration between physical and virtual realities. The focus on ethical frameworks suggests a growing awareness of the need for inclusive and positive virtual experiences. The metaverse e-commerce industry, still in its early stages, is expected to reach $200 billion by 2030 with a 580% growth rate in six years. Amazon has integrated early metaverse technology into its room decorator marketplace, allowing consumers to preview products and brands before making a purchase. Statista Market Insights predicts a 30% growth in the global metaverse e-commerce market this year, reaching over $30 billion. By 2025, it is expected to reach $42 billion dollars with growth rates of 43% and 44% in 2026 and 2027, resulting in a market volume of $87.2 billion. By 2030, the global metaverse e-commerce market is expected to reach $210 billion, with Asia being the largest market, with China reaching $58 billion. The US market is expected to increase nearly seven times between 2024 and 2030, reaching $51.5 billion. By 2030, Metaverse e-commerce is expected to reach 1.3 billion users, with the user's penetration increasing from 7.3% to 19.5%. The Election Commission of India has introduced a virtual reality-based election metaverse for first-time voters in Gujarat, India. The facility developed by GTPL Media Group and Virtual Heights aims to revolutionize the voting experience for over 13 lakh first-time voters in the upcoming Lok Sabha polls. However, the metaverse faces challenges, particularly for young individuals residing in different cities for higher education or professional purposes. 
Ahmedabad, a hub of educational institutions and job opportunities in Gujarat, has a significant population of young individuals pursuing careers or higher studies. The logistical challenge of traveling six to seven hours to their hometowns may prevent many from exercising their right to vote. Proposals for alternative voting methods such as Google Forms or remote voting facilities are suggested to enhance voter participation. Media professional Preeti Dalal believes providing alternatives like postal ballots or enabling voting from any city would potentially boost voter turnout. Cage the Elephant have released a new song title, Metaverse. The earworm track is the latest preview of the Kentucky rock band's new album, Neon Phil, which will be released on May 17. It follows a previous track's Good Time, Out Loud and the album's title track. The Grammy-winning group will support the follow-up to 2019's social cues with a lengthy North American tour this summer. Yuga Labs creator of the Board Ape Yacht Club NFTs has partnered with Somnia, a blockchain technology company, to enhance interoperability across the metaverse. Somnia's high-performance L1 blockchain and innovative Omni-chain protocols support hundreds of billions of transactions per second, setting a new standard for connectivity within the metaverse and gaming ecosystems. Yuga Labs will provide its NFT holders with enhanced utility and new incentives. The partnership will integrate the Somnia protocol into the other side metaverse, increasing the functionality of digital assets and allowing avatars to participate in metaverse events. Yuga collection owners will have the privilege to showcase their NFTs, engage in quests and earn bonus points on the metaverse browser, a decentralized portal similar to popular gaming platforms like Steam. The browser simplifies user interaction with metaverses and applications within the Somnia ecosystem without requiring prior knowledge of Web3 technology. Paul Thomas, founder of Somnia, said the collaboration aims to enhance the NFT ecosystem, offering holders a gateway to immersive, interactive experiences. That's all this bulletin for now. This is Meeruchi Sharma signing off. Do like, share and subscribe to 3 TV. and for more information stories, log on to our website www3 or scan the QR code.